Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Postal Package Partner Webinar, one of a series of educational webinars from WindowBook. My name is Monica Lundquist, and I'm the Postal Affairs and Technical Support Manager here at WindowBook. I will be presenting the introduction to the webinar, which will be followed by a live demo of the PPP software by Teresa Tabor, Shipping Products Manager. The agenda for today's webinar is to provide information about our Postal Package Partner software. First, we'll describe some of the functions that PPP allows you to do. We'll then turn it over to Teresa to give you a high-level demonstration of the basic functionality of PPP. PPP is software for facilitating shipments through the Postal Service. It provides for either file import of shipment data or manual input. The software allows you to print shipping labels and generate shipping manifests. PPP supports a variety of mail shipments, such as first class, priority mail, express mail, parcel post, parcel select, bound printed matter, library mail, media mail, and a variety of international mail shipments. PPP also provides for many automated functions, such as an automated and customizable email shipment notification. It also supports electronic delivery confirmation, signature confirmation, return merchandise shipments, and supports numerous scales and printers. PPP also provides support for priority mail open and distribute and express mail open and distribute, which are great ways of taking advantage of drop shipping for smaller volume shipments. We do offer a separate webinar on this topic, so please check out our website for upcoming dates on that webinar. PPP allows for a real-time connection to your parcel database and also provides support for electronic return receipt service and for private parcel insurance. Now that we've explained a little bit about PPP and its many available functions, I'm going to turn it over to Teresa, and she's going to be giving us a high-level look, high level look at the software itself. With that, I'll give it to Teresa. Take it away. Okay. Hello, everybody. Um, here I have my Postal Package Partner Monitor up. Um, basically what this product is for is for single piece mailing. Um, and a lot is to do for, um, to use the special services for in particular like delivery confirmation um, and also signature confirmation. We have two ways of getting data into the system. Um, one is via an import if you have a text file of some sort. Um, you can use an Excel or a um, ASCII delimited, um, fixed, or comma, or tab delimited. Um, and the other way is through an ODBC connection so that if you are processing mail and need to weigh each piece um, and you want to just enter, a lot of times folks will scan a packing list or um, something of that nature in order to pull in their orders. Um, so there's really two types of um, things are you know useful for PPP. Um, the first one is, is the import that I'm going to go over, and that's ideal for folks doing more, um, you know, um, batch mailings. Um, in other words, if you're doing a marketing piece or something, everybody's getting the same piece. Um, and you want a way to print your delivery confirmation labels, um, then that's what you would do is do the import. So I'm going to come into import export. And then I'm going to click on import data. It's, it's quite easy to create a template. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do that for you so you can see how easy it is. Um, once you have them, you can reuse the same templates um, all the time so that, for example, if you had um, different customers. Each customer may provide you a different input file um, in a different format, so you can set up the um, different import templates for different purposes. Um, or if you're just using um, to mail your own mail, you can um, use the same template if, you're, if your file is in the same format every time. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and add a template. Um, and here I can choose whether I want to do an addressee or a package import. For this purpose, I'm going to do a package because what I want to do is picture um, I want to import.